Hey friends, so lovely to have you here. I'm Heather Bradbury and I love painting photorealistic images and I love helping people find their creative voice, especially through painting with oils, which I love so much, of course. So today we're gonna to do a fun little activity which looks at the tones and the values and helps you understand them a bit more. And we're gonna do an exercise where you only do 15 strokes. Yes, whoop, 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 upside down, here we go. This is what we're gonna be painting. There is only 15 strokes here. So this really gets you thinking about where do I put my brush to get that dark image, or dark shadow? Where do I put my brush to put that lovely light highlight? And it gets you really thinking in your brain. Well, I'm sure you don't think with your feet, but think with your brain. <laughs> where on earth do I put that color and what color do I put where? So let's have a little bit of fun with it, all right? So you will see down below, there is a link to a PDF, which is this here, which actually has a few other exercises in it as well, which will end up showing you very briefly. So you'll get to look at some tones, but then you'll blend them with black and white and look at some more tones and blend them with your colors. So that's another great way of really experimenting with how you can see where are those colors. And I, I love that exercise. So. But for today, we're just going to do the 15 one. 15 one? That's what I'll call it, the 15 one. <laughs> all right, okay. So what you need to do first is, you know, it says it all here in your document here. It's got the colors and everything you need. So I have over here a bright red, a golden yellow, magenta, a brown, and a white. Um, probably don't need black. Maybe, actually, I think I might throw black in there. Uh, maybe not. Yes, I do. Yes, I think I will. I'll put some black in because I think I'm going to mix up um, the magenta. I'm just gonna make it a bit darker with some brown and all that sort of there. It's very dark, isn't it? I'll make it a tiny bit lighter, add some light to it. All right, now in this picture here, and we'll keep going with that. Where is it? I lost it over here, here it is. Okay, you can see there's sort of a light pink color. So now I'm gonna mix up a bit of that color. So you wanna have all your colors ready to go. On your canvas because you don't really want to be thinking about um, mixing colors because we're just going to get in there and have some fun with that so I'm just going to mix up a bit of this sort of pinky color all right I'll get some medium out Whoop. just going to tip some on here for today you can put it in a, in a container or something like this if you want to I'm just going to put it straight on the canvas today all right so that'll do for there maybe a little bit more yellow a bit more white because I had a lot of black on my brush all right um, and then we've got the golden yellow there uh, bright yet red bit of brown okay let's see how we go now I'm just gonna wipe my brush so that I don't have much paint on that I'm gonna do a smaller version of this uh, on here all right let's see how we go 15 strokes people see how I go first off we're gonna do a dark color uh, just make sure we've got enough medium on there all right and enough paint I'm not sure I mixed up enough paint, but that's all right. So we'll make it small. In fact, I'll do two. See how we can do it go. So we go one. That's one um, stroke. Oh, I'm not sure I like the shape of that. All right, I'm going to wipe my brush. Uh, I'm going to go for two. We'll get some red. We'll go two. Three, four, <laughs> wipe my brush. All right, we're doing to do this up the middle here. Um, I have to mix a bit of color. Oh, it's this one, maybe. Uh, what do I say? We're up to four. Okay, so it's five. Oh, we didn't have enough paint on that. Oh, well, five. All right, now we're going to do some, I'm going to mix up more colour because I didn't have enough. You need paint if you're going to paint. I just didn't have enough. So we're up to five. Okay. Five, six, seven. Mm-hmm. Uh, wipe again. Right, let's do the top bit. Seven. Go eight. 
right, eight. I'm going to try and do this bit again. So I wasn't happy with that. Get some more paint. Mix up more paint. Uh, well, up to seven. All right, so we're going to go eight here. Eight. Eight. Nine. All right, we need a little bit of a dent in here. Right. Ten. A bit of brown. Eleven. Oh, that's very thick. <laughs> All right, we need to do the white now. Twelve. Oh, I could almost leave it there, you know. Um, what do I want to fix up? Twelve. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. <laughs> look at my pad. Look at my hands. Uh, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. We've got three more strokes. What can we do to fix it? Um, okay, I know. I'm going to grab some red. We've got three more strokes, eh? I'm going to go here. I'm going to go. Twelve. Twelve. That's a bit better. And then 13. Hmm, I might make that wide a bit better. 14. That's better. And then I'm just going to go 15. 15. There we go. All right. How did you go? Or how did you go? How did I go? Not too bad, except I've got paint all over me. Let me paint do this again all right I'm gonna do it once more this time now that I've got my colors sort of worked out clean the table as well all right this time I'm just going to mix up a bit more of this color so that I've got everything ready this time get a bit more yellow out all right and I might just get a sm oh, smaller brush so I can do that stem as well. Okay, let's try that. All right, let's go again. Okay, let's see if we can do it in less. Mm. All right, I'm going to start uh, by whopping my brush. <laughs> All right, I like starting with the dark area. So we'll just get that color mixed up a little bit. I think it was a bit too dark last time. All right, there we go. All right, let's try a bit more medium. Okay, here we go. Ready? We're going to go a bit different shape. We're going to go one. Oh, don't go back. I nearly went back. <laughs> I might do this next. Two. All right, wipe my brush. Get some red. One, two. Three. Oh, I didn't have enough paint on there. Where's my red gone? Lost my red. That is hiding under paper. Okay, so one, two, we've got three. Look, I've got plenty, haven't I? I'm going to try again so they get that good. One, two, three. Okay, this is four. Four. Oh, I still didn't get it really well. Okay, let's go like this. Five. Oh, the shape of that bottom is not great. Five, but fun. All right, let's try for this interesting colour here. A bit more pink. A bit more medium. Make sure I've got enough paint on the brush this time. Okay, what have we done? One, two, one, two, three, four. This is five. Oh, no, I did one, one two, three, four. That's five. This is six. Six. Mm -hmm. All right, then we get more of this color. Try and make this a bit thinner this time. Six, so this is seven. Seven. Eight. Uh, all right, wipe my brush. <laughs> it's got a pointy bottom. Uh, I'll have to fix that up. Eight. Okay, let's go for nine. Nine. I think my first one was better. 
Um, I'll do the no, I'll do the orangey bit. Nine. Ten. Oh, it didn't look real well. Well, might get some brown. Eleven. Oh, nearly didn't have enough paint on there. Eleven. I still got to do the white. Twelve, thirteen. So I've really got two strokes to fix up everything else. I've got to fix this bit up. Eleven. I might try a bit of dark on the bottom there, just to fix the shape. Not by medium, not more paint. is 11. 11? Oh, yes. All right. I get the white happening. Twelve. Uh, 30 points, there's three more. So I want to get that dark patch in here a bit better. 13. Oh, that's a bit a bit darker. 13. I'm going to go here. 14. One last one. I'm just going to lighten this up. I'm going to make a light yellow, I think. Last one. Just going to do a bit of light yellow here. 15. There we go. Which one do you think's better? I don't know. I think the bottom of that one's better. But yeah, cool. I don't know. But hey, um, how fun. 15 strokes. But that really helps you see. Look, if I put it back there, way back, um, looks like cherries almost. But you can't, can hardly see those strokes, hey? And they you could probably tell they are some sort of a fruit. Yeah. So I hope you've enjoyed that. Um, it's a really good way to just have some fun and narrow in on those tones, those values and things, so that when you come to... Um, you know do your more photorealistic painting if that's what you're into you can really see those darks and lights and um, have a bit of fun with it I hope you've enjoyed it please uh, send a comment down below if you you know want to comment on anything that's happened in this video 15 strokes please let me know how you went you might be able to do it in five strokes I don't know but also you'll see the PDF where you get all of this information here down below as well and if you want to subscribe to information in the future any of these workshops please hit subscribe hit the little bell so you'll be notified and i hope to join you again sometime keep creating <laughs>